am back with another one. Basically, I want to show you my mealworms. Take a look. Close look. See all those? Poop painted in beetles every day. And that's not it. That is not it. But what I'm going to do is, you know, open this up. And I'm going to show you. Come closer now. Big farm. It's growing. Told you that was not it. I was not done. Look at all that. My goodness. That's what your farm would grow into. I need some more carrots. So I'm going to put some more carrots up in there. Jeez. I'm telling you. All fat. That's a lot. I'm gonna go get some carrots. Make sure you have a lot of carrots because you don't want to have just a little bit of carrots, you know, in here. You know, they got their moisture as well. I gotta separate these if you wanna see another video on that. Uh, check that out. Not yet, though. It's not coming out. It will be coming soon. And I just leave the um, dry on, um, what's it call it? Dry on, um, let it get really dried up. See, they're still on it, right? So they're still getting their moisture. So what I do is let the carrot dry way out, and then I'll take it out when it dries up. It does not mold, so you don't have to worry about that. You know, they don't mold. So this is, I let it dry, I let, let it dry like this. That's really dry. A dry um, carrot. That's when you know it's ready to be taken out. Let it dry up. They still get the moisture. I'll leave it alone leave them alone really too much. And what I do with these, take these bad boys out. One book. Like that. Like that. See what you want to do every day. Take them out. You don't want them to be thirsty and get the poop made at once. No, no. You gotta come out. They'll fight you too. Like, no, come on. I'm on. You just gotta go. I'm on the fighting too. No! I'm gonna stay. Nope. You gotta go. No! I wanna stay. They, they're trying. Wiggle, 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 wiggle. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Just a little bit. I'm on. There we go. out, taking them out, even if they're not all the way out of their shell, that's okay, if they survive, they survive, they don't, they don't, they're not sucking on my other ones, they gotta survive too, go get your carrots, get out of here, go get your carrots, stop trying to stay, just picking them up, some people say, I don't want to touch them if they're why, you know, unfinished, you know, dark brown, I leave it in there, no, no, no. They even white, they, they're okay, they'll brown up. Don't listen to everybody on this YouTube. They won't um, die in there. They're all family. As long as you give them enough carrot, they're not gonna be sucking on them. Carrots, you need enough carrots. Make sure you give them carrots. I mean, you see it low. Especially when you get a bigger farm, you need more carrots. When in the um, farm, you know, mine's, they don't need that much space. They say, oh, they need so much space. No, they don't. They're good. They're surviving. They're thriving, okay? Got a small one up here for the um, needles. They're okay. And then I got a um, large one for the mealworms, okay? What I'm going to do is, um, if I have time tomorrow, I'll make that video 
I'm going to um, post it if I make it, you know, tomorrow. And I'm going to separate. There's some bigger mealworms up in here. So I'm going to separate them. And I'll show you on that video what I'm going to use to separate them. If it's successful. This is my first try. So I'm trying to figure out how can I successfully uh, move them. So that's what I'm doing. I'm gonna figure it out. You gotta figure it out, honey. And that's what I'm ooh, that's what I'm gonna do. So I'm only gonna do it once. I'm not gonna do it all the time. This is my one time only and I leave it alone. I'll separate it outside. Let all the mealworms if it goes down, it goes down to the bottom. So I got all of them out. See? No, um, basically, um, beetles. No more beetles. You ain't got, look at this one. Look at that beetle right there. Um, thumb is on, basically, um, deformed. Some is deformed. Like that, so you're gonna have that. I'm gonna happen. But look at those beetles. Like I got a lot of beetles. Lots of beetles, guys. Tons of beetles. Some is hiding because they don't like the light. You know, they was out. Now they're hiding. You know, now I got a better view. A little bit. Got tons of carrots to put in there. You need. I got tons. I got the white ones in there too. And they will turn the um, color, don't worry. So, it's like, oh no, don't put them in. No, I'm gonna put them in there. My, trust me, they're surviving. They're survivors. They're good. They're not the going arm. So, I'll go in here. It is, look, look, they wiggle. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Tons of them. I can hear them moving around. Is that bad? It means I got a lot. They're moving. Tremors! Someone help! Someone help! There's a there's infest I'm infested with tremors. Little tremors. <laughs> See all those? Successful. Shoot. They're successful. I'm successful with this. So don't worry. You don't need a whole 500. Like I said in my other videos. 500 mealworms. What you gonna do with them? I hope you feed them off. Because I started at PetSmart. I get for one, one batch of mealworms. Then feed it off to my um, bearded dragon. Kept them, let them turn into beetles, and they have tons of babies, as you see. This thing's filled. All I do is hurry up, and I don't play. I hurry up and take them out. They don't, they're not hurting. And the poop eat ones. My little gecko don't like these too much. They'll eat them sometimes. One's hiding. You just turn when you grab them too. See, the difference is the small ones, that's, that, oh, that's a female. Those are females. That's how you, oh. Playing with these, that's one, that's, I'm not playing with you. Stop wiggling. Ooh. This one's a wiggler. I'm going to do that. Alright. Which one's a nose? This is a long one. You know what? I'm going to show you. So, this one. Right here. See that? This is a male, okay? 
how I could tell because they're bigger. This one right here. See that one? Compare these two. Right here. Come here. This is this is a female. That's a male. That's a male. You could tell because they're the females are smaller than the males. And they pupated. They look different. You could tell the king from the queen. Okay? That's how you tell, too. Look at that big one. That big one is a male. They're bigger. You'll see. They got the, the little dicks. You know, I'm sorry, but they got the little peepees. You know, be sticking out. You'll see it. But that's how you can tell. Early in stage. You know, I'm a little bit knowing about them. Because I have them. So, what I do is just pick them up and hurry up and grab them. I don't play. I do not play. I see them and I grab them. You have every day you be doing this. You want to keep up on it because I got mine in my laundry room. So it's really warm. So they can poopate faster. They say if they're in the cold, they poopate slower. But if they're heat in the heat, it poop back they poopate faster. And that's what they look at. See this one's it's about to poopate right there. You know, he's not changing to get bigger, he's poopating. That's cool, ain't it? So I just grab him like this. And every day. There's some more. Sometimes you might forget, but you won't don't want to forget. But if you do, it's okay. Because they poopate fast, though. Like I'm grabbing them. Like this. And make sure there's no more. over here sometimes they wiggle they wiggle a lot I'm like no don't take me so do this every day that's why I got tons in there tons of poop ate at once I take care of my stuff my farms and stuff I try you know it's important you know when it's money you don't want to spend no more millworms. I don't have to. I got doobie roaches. I'm letting them get bigger. You know, babies. Sometimes you want to let them get bigger so you can feed them off. That's the purpose. You want to feed them off, let them get bigger, so they they can be enough for your reptile. You know, oh, that just don't want to go. That's just that's really white. So that's just freshly, you know, pupated. it. And they're white like that. So I'm going to turn this. Look at that. All those. That's a great view right there. All those beetles. Just mating, eating all over that carrot. They're munching down like Thanksgiving. You know how family does it all together right now. Munching. Having their big meal, getting, getting that leftover bone, eat, eat it while I don't eat it to the bone, guys. To the nothing left. Make sure you have enough carrots. That's what you want. Enough carrots. I'm gonna put more carrots down here. You know, it'll come to the top where it looks like this dried up. It'll come to, to the top eventually. You know, I used to always try to dig through it, you know, like, look, um, you know, do they have enough? Oops, I dropped one. I did on the floor. Make sure I have, they had enough carrots. I just drop them in now. I got so many, you know, millworms. Just drop it in, you know, every two days, I'm going to say. You no, know, three days. However you feel, you know, if it's going too quick, so quick, you know, put do it every three days, but put enough like four to five carrots they be fine 
We just don't want them to eat on these poo-painted ones. Freshly poo-painted ones. So I'm just going in here. This one's dried up right there. That's okay. All right. Things done. But I'm gonna show you all that dust right here. That's all that dust. You know, one day I'll get to that too. Right now I'm not. That's why I don't move it too much. You don't wanna just dig and get all that dust up inside your lungs and children shouldn't be doing this either. I'm sorry, but their health is at risk. Yeah, so I'm gonna give them some carrots. I'm going to give them six carrots because they, they're always thirsty. They'll get it, they'll get it. They're right there. And they'll move and rotate and they grab it. Alright. Put that back on. That's how I do my millworm farm. That's all. Easy as simple. Easy as measies. White ones not being disturbed. I guess. I don't know. Look at them go. Look at those feet. I know you're just enjoying this. Yes, our bug watchers. All right, then. Thank you for watching this video. If you liked this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you want to see more of this, please subscribe. And I got a lot of videos. It's down below. A hashtag is all. And you just look at my descriptions and see what I have in in um, view for you. All right, then. Until the next video, please take care. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.